racetrack, we are happy to announce that today starts Baltic Touring Car Championship Devout Grand Prix season of 2022 and we have a great news after a break of several years uh, Porsche GT3 Cup returns to Riga and today we will see 16 cars. I drive it the first, first in 10 years ago when we started in Finland. And we, then we have uh, 2013 and 14, 17, 20 cars. And then it's go all the time a little bit up and down. And just now, 18 cars, it's wonderful. The track is uh, really nice, it's really fast. This is my first time here, I've never been here before. So I have to learn all the tricks of the track, but it's, it's amazing, it's very fast. A little bit scary because there is no room for mistakes. If you do a mistake, so then it's a <laughs> total crash. I feel amazing, first one of the season, quite a good feeling. We came here just to learn as much as we can for the next week, because I'm doing uh, Italian Carrera Cup. It's with the same car as this, so we needed to learn as much as we can because we had only three days of testing in this car because I did karting last year. So we came here to improve and we did that. The lap times were very close all the time and uh, waiting for mistakes of others and uh, that's the game, yeah? If there is no speed difference, it's very difficult to pass. The track is quite good, it's up and down, it's narrow as well, it's quite a fun. If you do a mistake, you go to the wall, so you need to be always concentrated, so it's a difficult track in general. My story starts in racing from 1972. It was my first uh, go-kart race then. And, uh, I drew with uh, go-kart till 1981 and started to rally and rally like 10 15 years and after 2003 I was like this is end of my racing it's enough already it's 30 years almost after 20 years I'm back here I have been uh, driving my Porsche for two hours. This was my first race. This Porsche Cup is very new for me, so need to get more experience. So, but uh, actually was also quite slippery. And uh, most thing was, I think that I got a lot of experiences for the next races. Yes, Porsche is always number one. It's, it's the best car in the world. We had to manage tires because the race one was very difficult at the end, and I didn't want it to end up with the same trouble. So I had to manage the tires, uh, push at the starts and uh, cool down the middle and push at the end and it worked, so all good. 